Developing tonight in Lemoore, an investigation is underway after an officer shot a 21-year-old man who they say was armed with a knife. It happened last night around 7.30. Police were called to a home on Kenwood Drive after getting a call from a concerned neighbor. CBS 47's Dennis Valera is doing double duty tonight and talked with the man who called 911. Hearing, you know, a bunch of screaming and yelling and obscenities, glass breaking, stuff banging in the garage. Um, decided to stay out here for a little bit, and once the uh, screen door kind of flew off its hinges is when I decided to call the police. Zachary Madden saw everything from his front yard. I asked him to sum up what happened in one word. He replied, chaos. It was just kind of a kind of mass hysteria, you know, people, you know, rushing to... You know, see what was going on. Lamore police say Madden's call prompted dispatch to send over two officers. One knocked on the door, and almost immediately after a woman answered, the suspect bolted out, tackling the officer who knocked. The second officer noticed the suspect had a knife and made the quick decision to fire five bullets. This particular incident is probably the worst one out of the numerous that have been called to that house. The suspect, identified as 21-year-old Zondon Michael McDaniels, is reported to be in critical condition but is stable. Madden says he's glad no one lost their life in this, especially since the community just lost Officer Jonathan Diaz just last week. It's always a tragedy when, you know, anybody gets hurt. Dennis Valera, CBS 47 Eyewitness News.